in what might be an ironic twist, inmates at the country's toughest jail are sprucing up bikes for needy children this Christmas. About 20 bikes destined for children in care in Manurewa have been given a facelift by inmates at Auckland Prison at Piremoremo over the last few weeks. Our reporter Katie Doyle went into jail to take a look. Christmas is a hectic time for most New Zealanders and it's no different behind the bars of the prison at Paremoremo. Inmates are hurriedly working to refurbish bicycles in the workshop. Most are either donated or picked up from dumps. Corrections recycling instructor Nicholas Bosworth explains what happens next. The bikes come in usually in a really bad, uh, disrepairable state and um, sort of rusty and broken down. So we just normally strip them back down again. I get the guys to strip them, strip them back down, repaint things that need repainting and just um, break down a couple, one, probably two bikes to make one good bike. So we're actually recycling parts off another bike. Each bike takes between one and three days to refurbish, depending on its condition. One inmate, who we'll call John, says his favourite part is the test drives. I actually um, quite like doing the smaller bikes, and so it's quite fun for me to, me being quite, quite large, to ride around on the smallest possible bike. Uh, <laughs> do you like honing around? Yeah. Once they've passed a safety test, the bikes are donated to charities throughout New Zealand. This Christmas, Corrections is donating 20 bikes to Oranga Tamariki and AMI Insurance are donating the same number of helmets. They'll end up in the South Auckland suburb of Manurewa with some of New Zealand's neediest children. The project has been running for two years. Another inmate, who we'll call James, has been working it for a large part of that time. He says the idea of playing Santa to a needy child is a real motivator. As offenders we've hurt a lot of people and some of us have hurt children and to be able to give back, to give something to a child who has nothing, that's a real buzz. It's really awesome to do that. Do you ever imagine like who's going to get the bike that you're working on? I do in a sense because I think when I'm doing a bike, what would the child want? What, the, what would the person want? And I want to try and make the bike the best that I can so that someone will get something that they're going to really love and really enjoy for a long time. And Oranga Tamariki coordinator Nahi Harding says the children love them. For a lot of our kids in um, the area that we work in, they either don't have bikes, they can't afford bikes, and the financial situation doesn't allow for that to happen. So a lot of these kids that are going to get these bikes will absolutely treasure them. For some children, these bikes and donated gifts may be the first Christmas presents they've ever received. Well, if you saw them, you actually saw their faces on the day that they had these Christmas parties, they light up. They're like Christmas trees. And while the Christmas rush may be about winding down, the inmates say there's still lots of work to do and many more bikes and recipients that need TLC. Thank you. Takitama. At Purimurimo for Checkpoint, Katie Doyle. And if you'd like to donate a bike, you can call Auckland Prison on 09442 6600. That number again, 09442 6600, and they can help sort that out for you. We'll also put that number on our website as well, and you can check out Katie's story on the web too.